In the bustling heart of modern cities, protection and movement often exist in tension. How do you allow people and vehicles to flow freely while at the same time ensuring safety, security, and control of public spaces? The answer is not always found in towering gates or walls, but rather in something subtle, hidden in plain sight, yet profoundly important. Rising from the ground with silent authority, automatic bollards have become one of the most effective tools in modern urban design. They are the quiet guardians of streets, plazas, and entrances, separating order from chaos with the press of a button. Today we explore how these devices work and why they've become indispensable in the age of smart cities, right here on History of Simple Things. At their core, bollards are simple structures. The term bollard historically referred to short, sturdy posts used on docks to secure ships with heavy ropes. Over time, their purpose expanded beyond the harbors and into city streets. Now, bollards can be found almost anywhere, standing guard outside storefronts, lining pedestrian zones, or protecting important landmarks. Their basic role is always the same, to block vehicles while still allowing pedestrians to pass. Yet, while many may only notice them as pieces of street furniture, they serve a deeper purpose. They are the markers of safety, guiding vehicles where they should and should not go. Of course, bollards are not all the same. Some are fixed permanently into the ground, offering a constant and immovable barrier. Others are removable, designed to be lifted out when access is required. Then there are retractable and flexible bollards, which can bend or sink into the pavement. Each type is suited for a specific need, permanent ones for critical protection, temporary ones for events or restricted zones. But among these, the most sophisticated and versatile are automatic bollards, capable of rising and disappearing as though the street itself were alive. These devices bridge the gap between security and accessibility, blending strength with adaptability. So how do automatic bollards actually work? At first glance, they may seem like little more than cylinders that slide up and down from the pavement. Yet behind this smooth movement lies a carefully engineered system of hydraulics, electronics, and safety mechanisms. Inside the ground beneath the bollard sits a chamber housing the lifting system. Depending on the design, this can be powered by hydraulics or electromechanical motors. When a signal is given, whether from a security guard pressing a button, a program timer, or a remote control system, the machinery activates, pushing the bollard upward to block vehicles or retracting it to allow access. To the casual observer, the action is seamless. But in reality, it is a highly coordinated interaction between pressure, force, and control. Hydraulic systems are among the most common in high security installations. They work by pressurizing fluid inside a cylinder, which then forces a piston to extend. The piston is connected to the bollard itself, lifting it smoothly out of the ground. Hydraulics are powerful and can raise even heavy, crash-resistant bollards in seconds. They also offer durability, capable of repeated cycles without wearing out quickly. On the other hand, electromechanical bollards use electric motors and gears rather than pressurized fluid. These are often easier to maintain and install, especially in places where heavy-duty security is not as critical, but convenience and reliability still matter. Both systems share one goal, to provide a barrier that can rise and vanish without disrupting the flow of daily life. But automatic bollards are not only about going up and down. They are built with layers of intelligence and safety features. Sensors can detect when a car or a person is nearby, ensuring the bollard does not suddenly rise and cause damage or injury. Many are tied into access control systems, such as key cards, license plate recognition cameras, or even emergency overrides for fire trucks and ambulances. In critical zones, bollards are tested to withstand the impact of a vehicle traveling at high speed, effectively stopping threats in their tracks. Their strength lies in not just their physical build, often made of reinforced steel, but also in their integration into wider security networks. 
They can be programmed, monitored, and adjusted as part of a larger urban infrastructure. One fascinating detail is how automatic bollards are designed to balance visibility and subtlety. When deployed, they stand as clear, undeniable barriers, visual signals to any driver that the path is restricted. But when retracted, they nearly vanish, leaving only a smooth patch of pavement behind. This dual nature makes them perfect for environments where aesthetics matter as much as function. Historic squares, corporate headquarters, embassy entrances, or pedestrian shopping zones. The public often overlooks their sophistication, assuming they are simple poles. Yet every rise and fall is the result of careful design, ensuring that they not only protect, but also blend seamlessly with their surroundings. In a way, automatic bollards reflect the future of urban planning, adaptable, discreet, and intelligent. They answer the question of how to allow a city to breathe freely while maintaining security. Whether they are protecting against accidental collisions, guiding traffic in complex spaces, or providing defenses against deliberate threats, automatic bollards embody a design that is both practical and forward-looking. And unlike permanent barriers, they do not force a city to choose between openness and protection. They provide both, depending on the moment's need. As we look at these devices, it becomes clear that automatic bollards are more than simple posts. They are part of a philosophy of smart security, one that values flexibility as much as strength. They allow public life to continue without constant reminders of danger, yet they stand ready to act in an instant. In every rise from the pavement, there is a quiet message. Here is safety. Here is control. Here is the invisible hand of engineering keeping order. So the next time you walk across a plaza or drive through a restricted gate, take a moment to notice what lies beneath your feet. The automatic bollard may not boast the grandeur of monuments or the visibility of towering walls, but in its silent movements, it carries the weight of modern security. It is the unsung defender of our streets, emerging only when needed, disappearing when not, and embodying the perfect balance of strength, elegance, and discretion. That is how automatic bollards work and why they matter more than most of us ever realize. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.